guys. I thought you could use some help with the plotting survivorship curves data. So I have it open here. It says um, in this first paragraph, the reason for plotting survivorship curves on semi-law graphs. And then on the third uh, paragraph, it says plot this percentage surviving columns from your data tables on the grid for the three bubble populations. It says you will add a series for each, but that's going to happen automatically. So don't worry about that. I hope you guys got outside or are going to go outside to do it for one, because it's a beautiful day and it's good for you. And secondly, the bubbles can make the floor slippery. So I want to be safe. I'm going over to the data sheet that I provided for you on Canvas. And just remind you, it says plot percent surviving columns. So to be honest with you, um, I'm not a Google Sheets Pro by any means. I'm not sure how many um, rows that I should highlight on here. Well, I think I'll just do 11. This is fake data, by the way. I just threw in some numbers in order to show you guys how to do this. So I clicked on this first box and then I'm holding down the shift key and I'm clicking on the next box and that way I get a range. And then I want these two as well. So I'm gonna hold down the control key I haven't figured out a way to grab this all at once. So I'm just with the control key held down, I'm just clicking on the boxes that I want. And then I'm going to insert chart. And it gives us a bar chart, which we don't want. It has the chart editor already open. So we're going to change that to a line chart. And then um, see how it says series when we already have that in automatically under customize choose vertical axis and click on lock scale and you can see how that changes so, um, hopefully your data resembles our type 1 type 2 type 3 survivorship curves but it might not so it, it'll be interesting to look at our data I'll close the chart editor and now you can grab this and move it around in your mini lab you are going to copy and paste this into your lab and also your data table so you can um, highlight copy paste or you could do a screenshot whatever works 